her partner in crime, Charles Gibson. We welcome you all back. 23 million Americans suffer from severe migraine headaches. That was a figure that really stunned me. And who of us hasn't had a tension headache or sinus headache? Well, this morning, we're going to show you how this tiny piece of plastic, can you come in close here a second? That's it could be able to change all of that and really ease the pain. And we'll have a brand new report for you coming up in just a minute. Well, a simple device has just been approved by the FDA, and it could be what the doctor ordered for 40 million Americans who suffer from migraine, tension, headaches, all kinds of headaches. It's called an NTI. And you wear it over your two front teeth at night, believe it or not. And apparently it helps prevent migraines, tension, headaches, and reduce the intensity of jaw clenching during sleep and really reduce the intensity of the headaches as well. Joining us now is Dr. James Boyd, a dentist who invented the device, and Ivy Mansky, who has seen her migraine. She says virtually disappeared since she started using it. Welcome to you both. You. Ivy, let me start with you. How Thank severe you. were your headaches? They were quite severe. I would get them, I would get two to three migraines a month, and I would get a sharp pain that would repeat in one area wherever it would be and I would just have to close my world off until it's ended. And you started using this, you stumbled on it how? My husband is a dentist here in Manhattan and he had been working with Dr. Boyd and found the NTI night piece mouth guard and it's a type of device that has reduce the intensity of the clenching people do and he suggested that I wear it. He experienced me having these migraines and said try this. All right so your husband worked with Dr. Boyd and Dr. Boyd I can hear people sitting at home and saying wait a minute here, wait a minute. First of all the critics of this have said it cannot be this simple. It cannot work this simply that migraines are caused by a variety of things and you can't tackle them with one little piece of plastic. Right, right. When you hear the term jaw clenching, you, it's hard to make that association or that leap to migraine. And that truly, they're, they're not really the same thing, of course. There really is a neurologic storm that happens during a migraine event. And what we've been trying to do is reduce this kindling that precedes this storm. And by reducing the intensity of muscle contraction of the patient's scalp while they're asleep, you reduce the frequency of the migraine event. So you think that migraines are exacerbated by what? By this clenching by the, the nerves all over the skull, and that's what you're attacking? Exacerbated might be a good term to use in that this jaw muscle contraction, and when most people think jaw muscle contraction, they think about this jaw muscle, when in right. fact, the most intense muscle for correct clenching the jaw is up here in the temples. It squeezes this way. You can feel those bulge in and out when you squeeze your jaws together. If that muscle is allowed to contract with high degrees of intensity, which, by the way, which migraine patients do when they're asleep, their frequency of migraines can be increased. What results are you saying that you see from this? In our clinical trials, 82% of migraine patients had a 77% average reduction in their migraine frequency. In frequency? Right, right. 77%? That's right. big. You said that you had migraines, too? Right. I had a headache every day, all day long, for 12 years. I would woke up in the morning, took my four excedrin to get out of bed, and took about 12 all day long, just to deal with my chronic headache and frequent migraine. Well, the, uh, the critics have also said, hey, this is going to cause another kind of problem. Maybe it'll take a while. But if you sleep in something like this, you'll be dislodging your jaw in some different way, and it'll show up later. I think it's sort of a knee-jerk reaction. In dentistry, the concept is make sure your teeth fit together perfectly. Because you know when you have a spilling done, they always want to check your teeth to make sure they fit just right. The problem is with this condition is they put their jaws together and squeeze them tightly. Well, all this device does is reduce the intensity of nighttime jaw clenching. All humans clench their jaw at night. It's the intensity that drives the condition. Again, we said the FDA just recently approved it. So, Ivy, what is it like to sleep with this? It took Does it me drive you crazy? Well, the yeah. first night, it drove me crazy. It disrupted my sleep. I needed to... I kept waking up and taking it out. And then I wore it in an afternoon. And I thought, let me consciously cooperate with this. And it took me three nights to get used to it. And in the six months that I've been wearing it, from two to three migraines a month, I've gone to one, I had one migraine in six months, which has been incredible. And these are available generally? At the general dentist office. 
at the General Dentist Office. All right, if you want more information on NTIs, you can always go to our website and we'll tell you more about it. It's abcnews.com, as you well know. And we thank you both for coming Thanks in this morning. Thank you. I know people who have these headaches are desperate, yeah. desperate for something that might help.